These are the top headlines about artificial intelligence for May 15th. How AI is reshaping online meetings. Source, web-strategist.com. How AI will change the workplace. WSJ source, biztalk.com. This is how I created an entire project that fetches artificial intelligence news and then generates this video in After Effects. Link to the GitHub repository in the description. So the first file is this one. It's a Python file that loads the .env that like the dot and we have some examples here you get the news api you get the 11 labs api that will be used in the second file and the voice id that will also be used in the second file let's go back to this first file in this first file you see that i'm using the news api that's strange because like the name of the api is news api so i don't know how how to reference to it if i say news api api that's kind of strange so never name your api with an api at the end because we know like it's an api so <laughs> let's go on um here are the parameters that i pass and these parameters basically tell the api what we want to receive as a return and i really want to receive um data about uh, artificial intelligence right so this is the carry that goes on like this is a function this function is executed inside the main function and what it, it gets is basically a response from the, the API of artificial intelligence subject you could use this domain right here parameter this domain considers that you only want to get response from these websites Okay, I was trying to do another project in which I scraped the websites to get the, the, the a resume of the information uh, and I would send that over to the video and I successfully did that but I was very worried about copyright issues so I decided to not go with that and yeah so I basically turned it into headlines. Right so down here we have a set of articles these articles were returned by this this function up there and we loop through it and then we create a json a json file that would have these parameters right title url source publish that and these parameters we can use for various things um i tried to position them like um i tried to sort them by pop popularity and you can sort them as the way like you you wish and then also i only got the first like this is written five but it's actually the first 20 articles and that's just to like limit myself with the like the actual popular most popular articles and that's just because usually we make um shorter videos like i don't think people would stay along for a news video um over one minute and you can't really talk about 20 articles not even 20 like i pl pl placed here 20 and you you'll understand why i did that and let's execute this script right here because I'm talking way too much and I feel like if I just execute it, you guys will get a sense of what it does better. So this is what it does. It gets the title, URL, source, publish that for uh, the most popular news lately about AI. I've tried to even like this, one of the reasons I did this like place domains was to get only news about AI because well, the a, the, the news API, it returns some things that don't have to do with API generally. Like about from these 20 news, they might get 15 that is about AI, but not all of them are. See, like this Masters of the Universe Revolution welcomes Meg Foster. Like, I don't think this is about AI. So I just come here and manually delete it. Uh, these two news, I just saw that they were about it. ChatGPT, so that's about AI. This is about AI. I could come over here and I see that this is not about AI. Down here it is. Uh, let's continue. Innovative way to uh, machine creativity. I, I feel like this is about like a general subject that talks about AI, but I don't think this is. So I'll just delete it. This one too. Uh, I'll leave this one. I'll get this and delete that too, chat GPT, yeah, well that's basically what you need to do, like start actually trimming the, the JSON file to find what is actually talking about AI or not, okay, that's, that's basically done, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, about 12 
13, 14. Yeah, we got about 14 news um, headlines that are about AI. And what we're going to do now is execute the second file, and this is the audio generator. This audio generator uses the 11 labs, uh, the, these comments that I was trying to create other things. This basically uses the 11 labs API to, like, you can even use your own clone voice, but I tried to do that and I didn't have really great results. Uh, like, not even close to the results that we get through their default voices, right? So this is going to loop uh, through the JSON file and what it's, what it's going to do is like the main part of this code is actually trying to not the main part but one big part of it is just trying to actually pass a, a, a way for the the 11 labs API to speak correctly, like to speak in a way that isn't really fast or isn't really slow. And to give these these names, so the intro and the outro, we I'm specifying here that we have an intro that should be this, and then it should say like May 1st or May 2nd. And this is basically for that, right? Uh, this this would get like the current day that you're you're making these audios. Uh, so let's go on actually I deleted some oh yeah we can't delete this <laughs> this is basically for creating the intro and the outro outro but I I deleted it because I already had it so just to just to not spend so much money on 11 labs then I comment it out but you can't comment that out right now let's execute this script and see what it does well here it's done processing so re remembering the first thing we we need to get is how AI is we we shaping online meetings how AI is reshaping online meetings and then the source should be webstrategist.com source web-strategist.com nice 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 that's pretty nice so yeah we get all, we got all the autos audios for these views correct the last one should be irish times apologies for hoax ai article let's see if it is irish times apology yep apologizes for hoax ai article about women's use of fake tan source the guardian nice so that's pretty well structured let's look at the intro these are the top headlines about artificial intelligence for May 15th. Nice. It's May 15th. That's a wrap for today. Subscribe to Lion's AI channel to stay in tune. Okay, great. So, yeah, we got all of the the, the, the live files um, correctly placed. And then, like, when you guys get this for from GitHub, it won't, won't have this because, like, it's really, it's large. It, it has a pretty large size. I mean, 5 mega is pretty large for GitHub, and I don't want to place that there. But you could have like any kind of file here. Like it helps that it it is the same size as the file that you want to create as a video. So like I just got these from Pexels. It's it's free to use, and yeah, that's great. And what it's basically going to do now is you're going to use this main.js file to read. All like it, it will read this file, the generated underlying script, JSON, and it will place the audio and like it will use the time of the audio to match the media. Because if it were otherwise, then like maybe the audio would like stay mute for a while or it would extend the audio and it would break the audio. So next we're going to open After Effects. After opening up After Effects, if you never used a script in After Effects, look, it's really simple. You just like open a, a new project and you come over here to File, Scripts, Run Script File, and you should go on to the video creator main.js. So now it's executing this entire script right here, main.js script. And I would advise that you guys took a look in this script because this was really tough to do. I actually used like a lot of ChatGPT to make this file because I never produced any other uh, After Effects scripts. Uh, so I 
even left these these comments right here some comments weren't even made by ChatGPT I made them so it could guide you guys to know like what this this is doing because probably you'll want to make your videos look more uh, like your channel or have your own personality or touch and this is mainly where you're gonna adjust that like you'll change the font size here you're, you'll change like the positioning of that that text because currently it's creating a uh, a style that, that I made. So let's have a look at this, the video, how it came These about. are the top headlines about artificial intelligence for May 15th. How AI is reshaping online meetings. Source, web-strategist.com. How AI will change the workplace. WSJ source. See, like, it's exactly how I planned it to be um, with a few glitches, like this, this black screen right here, it shouldn't happen. And there's a way to fix that. I just didn't improve this code enough to, to, to reach that point. In some cases you'll see that you get a black screen instead of your background image and that just happens because After Effects, like I think it's because of my PC, like it isn't like a really great computer. So it might be bugging After Effects while it's creating its compositions. I didn't, I didn't even show you guys that we have a media uh, file, a media folder with a fixed folder that has the intro and the outro. This intro I created previously on Premiere and the outro I just got it from Plexos. I think it would like just be a, a great video for a wrap up. This would be like news that would be placed in the morning or something like so. And well, that's it. Uh, I would suggest that you throw this video on Premiere and place like a background music or I don't know, like made some 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 changes to it so that it fits more what your channel is about and how your channel um, color palette or any other visual identity that it has that's it for this video that's a wrap up and like my 11 labs voice ai would say that's a wrap for today subscribe to lion's ai channel to stay in tune